Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is kj 4 re and welcome back to Above Snakes. I'm just sitting here doing some fishing uh, because I am getting low on food. I find fishing is probably the best way to get food. And speaking of fish, I think I mentioned this last episode. I mentioned again, someone said in the comments somewhere that you can like trade fish for better fish at the fisherman guy. So I'm going to go over to the fisherman guy and see if there's any truth to that. Uh, you guys are giving me a lot of good tips in the comments. We're going to go over those now. All right, so... Put chest on hot bar for quick swap. Okay, so whenever I go into the uh, snow biome or the 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 prairie, which is the hot biome, um, I have an issue with my chest piece because it makes me uh, take damage when I go in the hot biome if I'm wearing it, and it makes me take damage if I'm not wearing it in the cold biome, right? So someone said, put it on your hot bar so you can quick swap easier. So I'm gonna like go over my hot bar here. So I think I want water to be number nine. Is there a zero? No. So water will be number nine, food will be number eight, and chest piece will be number seven. And then that way I could take it off and put it back on. Is there any visual representation besides my character if I put it on and take it off? Yes. You see how it's like got brown around it? Apparently bones uh, got to be cooked into bone meal in the cooking pot. So we're going to try that as well. Um, hey, Cage, everything you add to your house area moves the meter up a little bit. So the well, windmill, fence pieces, all that stuff. Okay, all right, cool. I didn't think about fence pieces. So like actually building up my base. So if I made, when I made my base twice as big, that actually helped. That's interesting. I thought it would have been just de decoration items, but yeah, apparently not. That is really cool. I forgot last episode. Could I, could I um grow carrots? I don't remember. I'm gonna have to kind of see about that. We're gonna have to go get more. All right, I'm done fishing for now. We're also gonna have to go get more clay. But I think for now, let's take a look at our little setup here. Okay, cotton planted, harvest. Three pieces. Wow, okay, so we could do carrots. Wow, three pieces is not a lot. Didn't I have to use one piece? So I only get, did I use a piece? I don't, I don't know. Let's do carrots next. So I have 13, I, I have 13 carrots. So I still have 13 carrots. No. So it took, so it took one cotton and I only got three back. So <laughs> that whole planting thing, uh, you know, I don't know, man. Doesn't seem that worth it. Also, someone said watering and fertilizing in the garden plots isn't worth the hassle. As far as I can tell, it just speeds up the harvest time. Guess his preference, but the amount of time spent harvesting water bones and producing fertilizer just is not worth it. Especially when you get more plots. Okay. Fair enough. That makes sense. I gotta think about where I wanna put my, my farm plots. I was thinking about making my entrance um, like over here. I'm gonna put like a big fence around this. And I'm thinking about making my entrance over here. So maybe I'll put more fa farm plots down here. I was gonna go check out the, uh, the trader, the fish trader, but it's starting to get dark. So I'm gonna just kind of hang out here and just clear out some, clear out some room here. And then we're gonna start, yeah. We're going to get this. We're going to get this show on the road. We're going to, I'm, I'm going to make a big fence and I want more farm plots. I should go get more clay when I can, because clay does take a, like a day or two to respawn. So I should get clay while it's out there. So I will do that as well in the morning. I think I'm going to go check the fish guy. And then I will go uh, grab some clay. We'll make more farm plots. We'll start working on the fences. Are these coffee pot. I did make coffee. It doesn't seem that worth it. Like, I mean, maybe it's just because I didn't make enough coffee. Very well could be the case. Oh, also, I want lights. I want lights. And I did see some lights in here I could make. And it took, I think it took iron. Here, let's put down some lights while it's nighttime. So iron and resin. I do have some iron and resin. Oh, resin, 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 resin. Resin, there we go. And let's grab some iron. I think I have some iron ingots. Yes, I got a couple iron ingots. Okay. So let's make a couple uh, of these. Uh, I don't know what they're called. They are called uh, candle holder. Candle holders. Just gonna make one for now to see if how good it is. There's all kinds of like standing light sources you can make, but as you go down in tech, I would imagine that the you know the more expensive ones that are lower are you know worth more. That's you know, who knows, right? Uh F. I hope that's not all it like lights up. Wow. That's absolutely useless. Wow. That's pretty trash, man. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, all right. Well, 
I guess this would be the other one. We need glass and fish oil. You know what? I'm not going to make any more light sources. Is that the best light source? Let me know in the comments, man. I don't waste my time. That's a crap light source, dude. Like, I think, honestly, I don't think the light sources are so much meant for you to see. I think they're more meant for the overall, you know, level of the base. Is that what we're going to call it? Base level? Yeah, sure. Uh, it's just about the base level. So, um, that makes sense. Also, sleeping in that bed is giving me a buff right here. Low stamina does not make you tired for some time. It's pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, so let's go ahead and again, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bother with the water or the bone meal and stuff. You're you're right, it's just not worth it. Spe I mean, especially if it just like only makes it grow faster. It's like whatever. Uh trading post, kitchen village. You know what? Let's just run. It's not even that far. It's just oh, never mind. Let's go to the village. The village is Yeah, let's go to the village. The village is a lot closer to where we're heading. Uh, yes. Okay, so now we're going up here. Yep, there we go. Yeah, that was a good choice. Good call, Cage. Good call. Alrighty, fish guy. I do have a lot of fish on me, so... Can I rob him again, or... I don't know, does this stuff respawn? Man, it's only rocks, man. It's a waste of time. Search this though. Fabric is very helpful. I like fabric. All right, you. Hmm. Hello there. Show him your fishing rod. Oh, that's right. Browse good. Ask about preparing fish. Let's ask about preparing fish. Depends on, uh, for that, depends on the, the time of day. I like myself some raw fish in the morning. All right, who cares? But whatever fancy. Okay, so that didn't say anything. Um, show him my fishing rod. Fishing rod uh, quality. Let's see how many bluegills you got. Oh, okay, hold on. I see you managed to make yourself fishing rod. It's not the quality I'm used to, but it serves purpose. Let's see how many bluegills you got. Two blue, two bluegills. Nice job. You know, you know what? I'll trade you this catfish for them. I caught the other day. Would you like that? Sure. All right. Here you go. So what the hell does that have to do with the fishing rod? Hook, line, and sinker. Wait. Oh, did he rob me? Um, if you want to eat them fishes, don't forget to gut them first. Also, cooking, um, you should also for cooking you should gut them. No one likes fish guts. Come back every time if you want to trade some fish. So, what's with the whole fishing rod thing? Is like I thought he'd be able to like make me a better fishing rod or something, um, but I guess not. He seems kind of pointless. Um, but I did trade some fish, so yeah. Oh, okay. So now I got two sturgeon. And again, I don't know what that does for me. I'm not going to gut the sturgeon. I mean, it's got to be useful for something, right? I don't even think you get extra guts for gutting it. So really don't see the point in that. So I harvested the carrots and they only give me two carrots. Now, I'm not sure if carrots give you a different output than other things. Like, because I got three of the cotton, but I also watered and bone mealed the cotton. So I'm not really sure uh, what the deal is there. I'll know more as, as I play. Uh, I'm going to have to do some quick um, cooking here. So let's go ahead and like that, and let's gut the fish that don't really mean anything. Gut. Gut, 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 gut. Come on. Gut it. All right, that looks pretty good. And let's go ahead and cook up some fish. I love this uh, fish skewer. It's freaking dope. And we're just going to go ahead, and then I'm going to go get some clay. I'm also going to put down a couple more foundation pieces on farmland for the clay. All right, so now my... I wish you could lock in your consumables. Like, I want to lock in, you know, uh, fish grilled fish skewer into number eight. And if I and if I run out of fish skewer, whatever, it stays as a ghost image. Do not undo it, please. That would be really nice. All right, let's go ahead and see what I want to put down. What is that? Plains, farmland. No, I don't care about that. Uh, we just need... Wait, I don't have any, like, actual... Oh. Huh. So I can't put down actual farmland. I did put down, I had two farmland pieces that were special farmland pieces. And I put this down for you guys last video. And then I put this one down after the fact. Let's see if we can unlock that other farmland piece. Cause it's kind of weird that I can't put down farmland pieces like wherever I want. Um, iron ore. I don't know if I have any iron ore. I do. I'll just take one. Oh, my allergies are killing me. All right, here we go. Oh, that's garbage. Yeah, that doesn't really do anything for me. Okay. 
Oh, I guess I can't put down any more farmland. I mean, I can put down this, but it's not really going to help much. Alright, fair enough. Uh, let's take our horse up there. Because why not? Again, with the carrots, um, I just, I gotta plant... I, what I have to do is I have to plant cotton and see how much cotton I get. Uh, when I don't fertilize it or water it. Alright, so let's look around. It's a little hard to see the clay. Like, right there, there's clay. Someone was mentioning, you ran right by clay, but a lot of times the, like... The... Wait, I don't want to show... Oh, you have to have it equipped. Um, a lot of times, like, it's like... I can't see it because it's behind trees. So that's... Okay, that's it for that clay. And then we got some clay over here. On the other side of the fence. Uh, has this stuff respawned yet? Does he sell stuff? I forget. Mm -hmm. uh, well done. Yeah, I got it. Maybe bring him back. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. I gotta go get his cows as part of the quest. I didn't really plan on doing quests today, to be honest. What I want to get is I want to get, like, a major farm going. The person who told me, like, it's not worth the water, the crops and stuff, he said, yeah, especially when you got, like, ten farms. So, um, yeah, I'm going to make a bunch of farms. So let's go ahead and make some more farm plots, as many as we could possibly make with what we have. And we're going to need more... Man, they take two clay each. I didn't even realize that. Son of a biscuit. That... So that's it. I, I can't possibly get any more clay. Maybe if I Maybe if I went along with the quest line. Maybe I will go along with the quest line because right now I can't get any more than the amount of clay I'm getting and it takes a day or two for the respawn. So it's going to take forever for me to get any decent amount of farm plots. So, all right, let's get the, oh, let's go to sleep first and then we're going to get the pieces we need to make more farm plots and we're going to start making fences because I want some fences around this, uh, around this, uh, front area, which I think will be pretty cool. Uh, where would I put the wood parts? Um, they've got to be in here, right? Nope. In here. There we go. T, T. Is there anything I could put away? Uh, let's put that away. Put that away. Alright, that should be pretty good for now. Um, yeah, we're good. Okay. So... Wait. Oh, beams. <laughs> Whoops. We need some beams, brah. So we're going to need, let's just do a couple of these. Do one and two for these. And then I'll do a bunch of wooden planks. I know I'm going to need a lot of wooden planks. How many wooden planks am I going to want to set up? Uh, let's just do one more. We can always make more. All right. So farm plots, please. Farm plot number one, farm plot number two. And, oh goodness, it takes two planks per fence. If these fences don't snap into place, man, and I don't think they're going to, that's going to be a problem for me. <laughs> it really is. I hate it when stuff doesn't snap into place. All right, so carrots, harvest. See, only two carrots. All right, the next thing I'm going to plant is going to be... I, gotta, I guess I got to get the cotton. I got to have it on me. So I'm going to plant the cotton, and I'm not going to... I'm not going to... I only need one. I'm going to plant the cotton. I'm not going to, like, bone meal or water it, and we'll see how many we get. If I had to guess, I would imagine you're getting one more one more of that item if you uh, if you bone meal it or water it. I don't, think, I don't think it's just about speed, although I could be wrong. Could very easily be wrong. All right, so let's take a look at the building, and we'll put this as number six and number five. So six. Does this have to be? Uh, all right. So I'm going to want this stuff to be connected to my base. So if I'm going to want this to be connected to my base, we're going to have to move this. And we'll just move it out there for now. All right, number six. He didn't sound happy about that. <laughs> he really didn't. I guess we might as well start growing more stuff because there's no reason not to. And I'm just going to grow more carrots because why not? So, and so. All right, we're 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 getting there, people. We're getting there. Let's see see how these fences go. Yep, they do not snap into place in any way, shape, or form. Ah, uh, five, rotate. 
I'm thinking... I think we even come out like this. Yeah, let's come out like this. Come out one spot. Uh, can we not zoom in? Can we have the fence out? This is going to be annoying. I can already tell this is going to be annoying. Let's go ahead and take this thing down. All right. Let's grab everything. Number five. And the fence has got to go like this. And I, yeah, so you can put it in between. All right. And then I guess it does kind of snap into place a little bit in a certain way, because when you rotate it, it does rotate on a, on a grid, which is really, really helpful. But I, I kind of wish they really snapped into place, like snapped into place, snapped into place. You know what I mean? You gotta get the right angle as well. And you can't spin the camera while the building piece is out. Like that. All right, is that okay? Let's make sure that's okay. It's all right. Ugh, I don't like it. I don't like it. All right, this is what I'm gonna do. Move that right there. And we are gonna move this. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna build it out like that. I'm just gonna do it like this. It's just easier. Okay. Re move this. Again, I can't move while I'm moving stuff. I can't move the camera while I'm moving stuff. The stupid tree is growing back. There should be like some kind of scorched earth thing that we can like put down so stuff will not grow back within our borders. Like maybe let me salt the earth or something. <laughs> it's pretty dark. Yeah, I got most of the fencing actually done. It's not, it's not that bad. It's a little expensive and it's a little annoying to put it down. And by the way, you can move around and stuff while you're putting down the fencing, but when you're moving it with the hammer, that's when you can't move around. Um, by the way, these are done, but I kind of want these all to be done at the same time. So I'm just going to hold off. All right. So we've got most of it done. We just need to come across here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I don't think there's any gates in the game of any kind. So I'm debating on whether I want to put a gate here. Um, it depends. It really depends. Let me uh, see if I can move this. Uh, oh, you can only tear these down. You can't move them. Oh, that's a bummer. I wonder if I'm going to be able to fit another one over there. I guess I won't know until I get clay. Son of a biscuits. Okay. All right. Well, it is what it is. Uh, can we make any more fencing? I don't think I could, but I don't remember what I was missing. Oh, I can. Okay. Let's make a few more pieces. Actually, that's pretty good for now because I am going to pick up a couple pieces um, because I want to have gates. Now, you can't, Like I said, you can't make gates when it's got like open areas. So I'm thinking my farm is probably going to be over here. So I don't know if I want a gate there or not. Um, let me think, let me think, let me think. I think we're going to move this one. That's going to be a gate right there. So now what we'll do is we'll take this one and we'll put it over here like so. Although I'm in the way. What's up, doggo? Okay. All right, so I'll put another one here. Now this is gonna, where, the one I'm putting down right now, I'm going to pick up. It's definitely gonna be an opening. I call it a gate. Actually, it'll probably be the next one that I put, that I take up. Um, I call it a gate. It's not really, why can't I zoom in? That's weird. I thought I could zoom in if I'm, all right, whatever. I guess it doesn't really matter. Uh, so what I do is, even though I'm gonna make a gate in certain spots, I still put down the fencing. And the idea is that I want the gate to be exactly the right amount of width. So I put down the fencing first and then I and then I make the gate. I don't know what I'm gonna do over here though. Go ahead and make a couple more. I should be able to almost basically finish this. And my crops are done, so I can go, you know, see what's going on with those. I did make a well as well. Uh, I ran out of branches. Wow. I think that's what I'd run out of. So this one can go right here, five. I'm trying to think about how I want to do this. It's gonna come out like this. Yeah, I, I think this could actually work. 
to you. Right there. Good enough. I mean, I could just leave this open here, honestly. That could be the, the gate area. And the reason I'm making multiple gates is because I'm coming up from the south. I don't want to have to run all the way around to get in. That doesn't make any sense. All right, are these all pickable? Um, um, planted. Yep. Okay, here we go. So the cotton, let's see what we get from it. Okay. So, all right, well, that's official then. If you, if you uh, water and bone meal your crops, you will get one extra plant from each. I don't think it's any faster. I don't... I don't think I don't think watering them in bone meal makes them faster at all. I think it just gives you that extra like you know crop. And I still agree with you. I don't think it's worth it. Not 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 by a damn sight. Let's see how this is gonna go. Again, I really wish my hot bar would remember where things go, even if I've run out of the material. All right, so let's do this. All right, so that is, this is gonna be a problem. Is it because of the stairs or the other fence piece? That I do not know. Right, let's just put this right here. Let's grab this one. And... Like that. And you, my friend. Feels like there should be another... You know what? I'm just going to leave it open. That's a perfect spot to leave open. Perfect spot. <clears throat> yeah. Well, maybe not perfect, perfect, but because maybe this one will be better. All right, hold on. Let's see if we can put this here. No, see, if we can't. Okay. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to grab this one. And we're going to grab this one. Oops. Come on. And then we're going to leave that spot open. Yeah, that's a nice, yeah. Well, it doesn't match up because this is too over. Oh, this one's going to be moved anyway, so it's irrelevant. Uh, as a matter of fact, I'm just going to do that right now. Let's go do some of the quests. I, I, I wasn't going to do any of the quests today, but you know what? In the interest of getting more clay, I'm thinking the quests uh, for Basil's farm will help me unlock more areas to get clay. And I'll also pick up some more clay as well. All right, so right down here are the cows, and we have to put on some special boots to have the cows follow me. I still haven't put down that well yet. I keep forgetting. So we'll put on these special cow attracting boots or whatever. Oh, they got little bells on. That's why. Come on, guys. Come on. Bells. Bells, bells, bells. Bells, 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 bells. All right, so they're not following me. Why aren't they following me? They kind of follow me, but not really. All right, do I just have to go slower? No, see, he stopped. He they just stopped following me. Hey, right, come on. Come on. Come on, guys. Maybe I gotta keep the bells making noise. Oh my god. This is... <laughs> this is the worst. It's like with uh, escort missions. You know? And uh, yeah, it is just not easy. But I am finally got him in here. Hopefully all I have to do is get him past this line. My dog gets in the way, the one cow gets in the way of the other cow, uh, the clay gets in the way, every, every blade of grass gets in the way. Oh, come on, you, you're right here, dude. Let's go. Thank you. Now drop dead, you freaking stupid bovine. There we go. Oh, goodness, that was a pain. All right, what's up, bro? <laughs> Oh my, there they are. Cool. All right, so we got a new world piece. Good, 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 good. What's up, Ryan? Happy to see your face again. These boots really did the job. Talk about boots. I think you deserve a good pair. Here are some boots. Um, thinking for the boots. Uh, tell him I want to learn about farming. Ask him how to get corpse. Uh, let's ask him how to get the corpse creek. I already started farming, so. And there you go. All right, it is almost dark, so I am gonna I am gonna head home. Here we are back at base. Let's see what we need to unlock those new cartography table thingies. Spawn a desert world piece. Oh, okay. Desert, huh? Mm. That doesn't sound good. 
All right, uh, moderate climate. So we've got grain field, um, ranch. Uh, these are old ones that I've already had before. Cold is normal. Warm is prairie desert. Oh, we're gonna need wheat. Okay, all right. We need for this just iron ore. I don't think I have enough iron ore for this stuff right now. Uh, nope, I definitely do not. Okay, well, next episode, I've got to go farm up some resources. We've got to unlock the green field, the ranch, and then start working on the prairie deserts. We're gonna probably going to have to get wheat. I could probably get wheat from the wheat field over there. shouldn't be much of a problem. Um, are all my crops done? Yes, they are. Harvest. I've just been replanting the same ones. Maybe I should do different ones. Let's do... Uh, yeah, let's do more... Uh, well, we actually got carrots coming in. Let's do more corn. I think what I'm going to do next episode is I'm going to work on uh, new recipes and stuff. Now, I'm not going to try and guess the recipes. What I'm going to do is I'm going to look them up online. All right. And by the way, I did I did buy the, the recipe for coffee. Um, so let's see if, let's see if we actually like, let's see what it is. Cause I've made like coffee before, but it wasn't called coffee. I used one coffee seed with water and it wasn't called coffee. It was just like something else. So I'm thinking you probably need to use more than one to get proper, uh, coffee. Um, coffee. Yep. Two. Okay. See, I wouldn't have known that. I wouldn't have known that. Although I don't think I'm ever going to really need fatigue to be honest, but it's nice to have it in case I need it. So next episode, we are going to unlock a lot more stuff in the cartography table. I would like to expand the farm and we will continue along with the quest lines by getting the desert. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.